Drill Squad back again with another quick video. I'm Tori, aka T. Thank you for tuning into the channel. Appreciate everyone who's been like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel. If you're new here, I appreciate it. If you like what you hear, you stop it by. Consider hitting the subscribe button if you're a returning subscriber. Thank you again for tuning in. Just wanted to touch on a couple things right now, really quick. Still got more videos coming soon, but just wanted to come at you guys to see what were your thoughts on the upcoming couple of releases. Now, for me personally, um, just like with the Toro 6s, I ended up passing on those and I'm going to end up passing on the couple of releases that I'm going to talk about today. So the first one being the Laney 14. Now, Laney 14 came out in 1999, again, 2015, and now again, 2023. Now with the 2015 version, I didn't pick that pair up. That was just during the time when I was trying to save some money and uh, I was being real choosy about what I was getting somewhat like right now so i didn't pick those up but i will say this i like the 2015 version a little bit better than the 2023 nothing wrong with the 2023 i did get exclusive access on jd sports finish line um and i ended up passing on it got it on the ship to my option and pick up in the store but i decided not to pick those up and decided to save money now one thing for sure that 210 price tag you know made me not want to buy those but let me know your thoughts on this uh the laney 14. now i do like what they did with the shoe again great colorway great style looks like it's got good style custom materials on there and you know i just like the colorway in general but for me i figured it was a pass and i was gonna wait to save some money for some other releases um but let me know down your thoughts if you have 2015 or if you don't have either one and you're going to be copying the 2023 version let me know your thoughts on this shoe now the second one that i wanted to talk about real quick is one called the vibrations of nyjah looking at the pictures and looking at the shoe it has that vintage vibe and stuff and everything and one thing i did see that it is called the vibrations of nyjah but also on the box i think it says that it might be part of the craft series so um just like with the craft fours um so it the, this might be the craft one so i'm not sure if anybody knows put me put it down below and correct me if i'm wrong and let me know if you're going for this or if you've already got a w on this through raffles or whatever now with this release it's not going to be on sneakers right now i think it got pushed back but at the same time too i think this is a neighborhood release and it's going to be mostly at a lot of neighborhood stores so if you do like this shoe um it, it is kind of interesting um it has that vintage vibe type on it it has those little small looks like i don't know like a scrub brush or something like that on the the uh, wings excuse me on the, the nike logo and on the top of the shoe i'm not sure exactly what that is but it's interesting um at first glance i'm like hmm that kind of looks like the old nigel Sylvester's that came out and a couple other shoes but you know for me right now it's going to be a pass even though it is only 180 and i do um like the shoe a little bit um but if i saw it in hand i probably would be like eh so it'd probably be a pass for me so you know for that it's not a drip um so it would be a skip for me uh, but let me know in the comments if you like this shoe and if you're going to be going for that uh, that brings me to my next point every release is not a cop so again you have to be picky and choosy just like for me i looked at the laney 14s and looked at the vibrations of niger and i'm saying to myself are these something that i'm gonna wear regularly yes no maybe so based on that i'm gonna say no and pass on those but not to say that i don't like the shoe not to say that i don't like the colorways but for me you have to be picky and choosy in my eyes um you know you can cop what you want to cop cop what you want rock what you want buy what you like that's what it's all about but for me right now you know i don't see it necessary for me to buy every single release that comes out so for those reasons i'm gonna pass on it let me know your thoughts down below what you think about these two shoes i know that there's some more shoes on the way some shoes got pushed back some shoes got moved forward so we're going to talk about those um upcoming and again like i said i do have uh, a review coming on a pair of airships and uh, i got a little rant about those as well again appreciate everyone who's been out there subscribing to the channel Again, like, comment, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Thank you for tuning in. Appreciate it. Remember, stay blessed, have a great weekend, and you're never too old to drink.